now our next senior, number 15, wide receiver, Reard Hudson. You know, when I came here, just hearing all the stories about the great players that played here before me and you know, how many guys that went to the NFL and you know, how many games they've won and, you know, the bowl, bowl games and conference championships and stuff. Number 69, defensive lineman, senior Alex Tucci, who is from Fort Lauderdale, Florida. You go, you come out down the ramp and you see the entire home side just packed and people on the hill and everything, and it's just pretty crazy. It's sort of like the town shut down. Go. Next year, number 94, defensive lineman, Sia Sia, who is from San Francisco, California. It was a big, it was a big transition from California to coming to West Texas, from big city to small town. It, it felt real different, but it was a really big move for me and my family. In general, I mean, walking out with your brothers, I mean, we, we grab each other's arms and we're walking out four by four, and you see that crowd, and it goes, it goes, that thunderstruck ACDC comes on, you see that buffalo right in front of you, and your heart starts pumping, and you're like, it's game time, time to go to work. be a wagon wheel on that, that hill and I'm hoping I'm gonna run after it after the game. That's what's gonna get me hyped up. Every time I'm tired I'm gonna look at that wagon wheel and be like, that's mine. They just been emphasizing wagon wheel from people saying it over the microphones I practice or to just playing the wagon wheel song constantly throughout the entire time. I wanna bring that wagon wheel back to these guys, you know, just because how much support that they have given me. I built a great relationship with the coaches. Um, probably my offensive coordinator, he's been here all four years that I've been here. And, uh, you know, just like in the summertime, we get together and play golf and, and uh, just like family away from home. I go on every day and he kind of gives me a father dad talk. And I sit there and I'm like, man, I've had these 10 times, but every day he still gives me one. And, and I, as I get older, I enjoy it. I have a tremendous amount of respect for the uh, coaching staff here. They're really supportive of uh, the team and the players individually. Yeah, I'm a business major, and so uh, I've gotten to learn how good um, our business school is and like the accreditations we have, and uh, just the, the professors have been really great and uh, supportive, and they've helped me out when you know, I've been gone for games and stuff and helped with all the workload. Uh, for being an athlete and just balancing school and, and football, I mean, it's, it's honestly not hard. It's just you got to be consistent with it. I'm about to receive my master's in education in the spring, so I've had a two degrees and every time I need some kind of help a teacher's there with like an open open hand like anytime I need any kind of academic help they're there. Man, West Texas football means a lot to me. They really took care of me while I was here. Hey. 